The Midwest Horse Fair is underway. That means there will be more traffic around the Align Energy Center. Officials say getting off on Rimrock Road, Rusk Avenue, and John Nolan Drive will be tricky for traffic. If you're driving near those exits on the Beltline or just near the Align Energy Center, pack your patience. It could be slow moving. The Sheriff's Office says they are putting signs along the Beltline to help drivers. And WMTV's Phoebe Murray reports from day one, the grounds at Alliant. Hoofing it into Madison, more than 700 horses are here on the grounds of Alliant Energy Center. Now through Sunday, wildly talented equine professionals in their own disciplines, including barrel racing, dressage, hunter, jumper, you name it. Skill levels from all across the industry. I like to tell people of any age, you know, kids or, or adults, that if something makes your heart happy, it's always worth working for. You know, there's always going to be the, the challenges behind anything you want to accomplish. It doesn't even have to be in the horse world, but if you love something, you don't give it up and it's always worth working through those obstacles. It's for the people that may not know too much about the equine world that this horse fair is really geared towards. And that's kind of the heart of the fair and that's why these breed groups and the different disciplines are here to showcase all the different breeds. Now on top of that, you've got 400 plus vendors, more than 30 world class clinicians and then dozens of both disciplines and breeds showcasing uh, what they do best over the next three days. And on Sunday new this year, both active military and veterans will be getting free admission. You can find a link to those tickets on our website, WMTV15news.com. Reporting in Madison, Phoebe Murray for WMTV15 News.